All right, hey everyone, it's the Jason with Elite CTV. Today we're back with another special video. I found an unreleased product. That's right, the Alakazam V Box. Um, it comes out January eighth, and I found it early at a at a local game store that also sells cards. Now they also um, scalped me a little bit for it. That should be twenty dollars retail this coming Friday, but I had to pay a little bit extra, twenty five for it. So, but while I was there, I found some cool Venusaur promos, and this is the gold Mega Venusaur from XY Evolutions, and this card is just so pretty, and it's only it was only 15 bucks, and it's a pretty good shape, really nice shape, actually, uh, a little bit off center on the back, but either way, a gold Mega from Evolutions, Evolutions has exploded, and I'm expecting this card to go up in the future too, because Evolutions has been hard to come by. And then this is an older XY promo. Um, if you remember, uh, there's a Charizard and Magmar and Flareon. Blastoise has Vaporeon and something else, and Venusaur has Bileplume and Scyther. Now, I don't have the Blastoise yet. I have the Charizard tucked away somewhere. And But let me not waste too much time. And this is mostly... Uh, Pretty much a vivid voltage box you're gonna get two vivid voltage packs and two junk packs pretty much and this is just opening this up early to see if you guys want it alakazam is finally being printed in the sets again because um that magician who sued pokemon a long time ago uh for kadabra rights to not print them finally lifted his ban so that's why you'll see more Alakazam in this set, especially. And then you'll see um, more Abra and Kadabra. That's the reason why they rarely print Abra, Kadabra, Alakazam. Because they can't print Kadabra at all. Oop, sorry about that. I had to pause. Get the battery warning. And you also get a Jumbo Boy. We'll set him up in the background. And we get four packs. Here's our code. And we'll get into this box. Let me... Stop wasting too much of your time. Also, my card store gave me a free pack of, of trash um, for buying $35 worth of promo. Uh, singles, I mean. Um, so they gave me a free pack of trash. So we'll save Crimson for the end. We'll get into Vivid Voltage a little bit. Hopefully we can pull Alakazam. Even though I already have one. But it's still a nice card. There's a code for whoever wants it. One, two, three. Rip our energy. And we got Mightyena, a nice doggo. Trumbeak giving somebody a nice kiss. Hitmontop and uh, Bay, I think her name is. People are obsessing over her, but Hitmontop's awesome. Beldum in the middle of a rainforest looking type of thing. Blitzel trying to get struck by lightning. That's not safe. A little nasty boy. Um, goat in the middle of the forest. Very cute Eevee. Ooh, reverse rare Snorlax. And a Grappalock. This squid will beat the hell out of me if you guys don't like, comment, subscribe. So please do it. If not, I'm just going to get my ass beat by this squid leader. Alright. Sun and Moon Base is the other pack in there. And that's kind of a junk pack. We got our code. One, two, three. Rip our energy. And we got a timer ball. Uh... Brion, pretty cool artwork. Poliwhirl in the middle of the pond. Poliwag, the Poliwhirl line is a very cool line. It's very underrated to me. I love Poliwrath. I know people don't really like Poliwrath. And Polito's amazing. Little nasty spider. I'd stomp on this thing if I seen it in person. Uh, Formantis in the forest. Morlow, this mushroom. Um, Haunted Sandcastle. Very cute Chitini. Ooh, reverse claymation metapod and to a hollow Alolan Doug Trio. Now, you might be wondering why I'm excited about this. is because I started a little collection of... Um, I'm going to make a, a binder for all claymation and hacky sack yarn art. It's going to be little, you know. It's by the... They're, the all the claymations are by the same artist. Um... Yuka Mori. I um, don't know if I'm saying that right, but either way, they make very good art, and I'm just going to make a little collection of all claymation arts. And then we got some very cute boys. Vivid Voltage. Again. Code. One, two, three. 
rip our energy and we got a gem goblin uh duot holding some clams opal with a very long nose like jack in her nose hacky sack this is what i mean by the yarn hacky sack style art so all claymation and all hacky sacks i'm gonna put in a little binder i think it'll look really neat when it's done ninkata underground which is a really cool artwork voltorb Rock Ruff with a little uh, cutie fly pissing him off and scratching his ear. Croker Rock and a Ampharos. This has been a good box so far. So first pack we had a reverse rare. Second pack hollow. Third pack V. Hopefully something good out of Sword and Shield. All I pull out of this set are Lapras. And this is the final pack of the box. So for that Alakazam box you get mini Alakazam promo. Big Alakazam promo. Two Vivid Voltages. One Sun and Moon base and one Sword and Shield base. Which overall is a pretty decent assortment. It could definitely be worse. There's boxes that are much, 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 much worse. Um, but yeah. Monkey Climbing on the Vines. Lucky Egg. Big old Sheep. I hate Double Way the Champion's Path. I hate that set so much. Uh, hoot Hoot. Bull Picks. Little Nicket running around. Ball toy. Very nice chin chow art. I like these bright colors and all that. Reverse blip hog and a non hollow drapeon. Let's get into this pack of trash so we can hurry up and end this video. Um, if you've seen the other day, I bought a Crimson Invasion uh, booster box in my last video. Uh, just for my sealed box collection. I already pulled um, the gold water energy in a previous video. So. The only really thing worth hunting in Crimson Invasion to me is, you know, the Rainbow Gyarados and you know, Haunter looking tree, a little nasty. Um, he might be Canadian trying to suck the sap off. Um, Akomo O, Luzamine, Swabaloo, very cute Swinum bar. I love Swinum. Swinum's a great Pokemon. Um, but yeah, there's no really reason to open a Crimson Invasion booster box. Like, the chase cards are a $35 gold energy. And a $50 uh, Rainbow Gyarados. So it's like, why open a $110 booster? Oh, hoo -hoo! I needed this for a Crimson Invasion Master Set. Well, not really a Master Set because it's not Reverse Hollow, but this is a card I was missing and I didn't know it was a Claymation art. Awesome. This got me very excited. Yeah, I bought a Crimson Invasion binder. I bought a couple Pokemon binders just to start organizing my sets in order. Um, I love the. Um, let me get it real quick. You guys aren't, probably aren't even watching anyway. But, if you're in this far, you know I appreciate you. Oh shit, I almost fell out my damn chair. Okay, so it's a Crimson Invasion binder, but it's not going to fit under my thing. But anyway, I got a Crimson Invasion set. It's coming along. But yeah, very nice Claymation star me. That's awesome. And if you made it this far in the video, like, comment, subscribe. I'm trying to get close to a thousand subscribers so I can start streaming off my phone. And I appreciate you, and have a good day.